Ready? Okay. Three, two, one, off. So what happens if you're flying a helicopter and the engine was to fail? In aircraft today, you don't have the luxury of pulling over when something's going wrong. You still have to get back to the ground, and you have to get back to the ground safely. If you did nothing, the rotor would stop, and the aircraft would fall out of the sky like a rock. So in order to not do that, we enter what's called auto-rotation. The hardest thing to teach someone to do is to auto-rotate. There's four parts of auto-rotation. The first part of the auto is the entry, and that will include three different maneuvers, down collected, aft cyclic, pedal and put, all at the same time. When the engine fails, the pilot only has two seconds to get the collective down and enter the auto rotation maneuver. If you don't reduce the collective and reduce that pitch of the blades within a few seconds, the drag of the blade will then cause the blade to stop moving. At that moment, there's no more lift in the helicopter and it will literally fall out of the sky. So after you're in the entry, you then have to do the glide. You need to maintain RPM, airspeed, and trim. You're constantly making small adjustments. You then have to enter the flare, pull aft cyclic to slow the aircraft down, then level it. As you get close to the ground, you're pulling up the collective, putting in pedal input to keep the aircraft in trim all at the same time for a successful auto rotation. Auto rotation is an incredibly complex problem. Just doing a bunch of them, uh, collecting all that data, it's hard to dissect all that information and actually come up with a solution to make a smart system that can compensate for all the different permutations in which you can experience an auto rotation. We start in the simulator and we're back and forth with the engineers tuning the gains, making sure we understand how it's going to go. But at some point, if you're going to make a successful auto rotation to the ground, you have to go to the ground. In July of 2023, on a Saturday, we performed the world's first fully automated auto rotation all the way down to the ground with Skyrise completely in control. Three, two, one, off. Okay. All right, we're in auto mode. Better. There's the entry. We're in the glide. RPM's good. Spot looks good. Speed's good. Altitude's good. Flare. It was surreal on the day of to have all this work come together and culminate in something that we know is going to be saving a lot of lives. It was just almost unbelievable. <laughs> I'm so proud of the team. We certainly are pioneering a new level of safety for this industry. Skyrise can now ensure, even in some of the worst emergency situations in any aircraft type, you will be able to get to the ground safely. Skyrise is truly the simplest and safest system in the sky.